I kick butt in heels. That's that's what I used to say when I was like on my you know warrior path with my yeah. son. I'm like, listen, I can because they used to say you're just a Playboy model. Shut up. I go, you know what? I can do a lot in a bra and underwear. I can change the world with my sword and my fist Absolutely. and my mouth. You don't need anything else. That's right. <laughs> she can and she never holds back. She always entertains. She's been doing daily now for. Four years on the Jenny McCarthy show on Sirius XM. We're back on Access Live with one of our favorites, guys, Jenny McCarthy. Yay! Here with Woo! us. Thank you. Your radio show, we we're just uh, talking yes. about Maury on. What did you get out of him when he came on? You know what? Maury was uh, a little t tight lipped, but I did get that he has a juicy sex life. Yeah. I was trying to get that out of him. Maybe juicy. on the radio, he thought he could get away with <laughs> well, it. Well, on my show, honestly, you have, I have 20 minutes. I'm not censored. Thank God. Yeah. And I get to ask whatever I want. So any publicist that comes in that says, "Can you not ask that?" You're like, "I'm like, going to ask outside. it." Yeah, can that's you right. Stay like the it. female Howard Stern. You well, get them talking. I mean, there's yeah. no one you can compare to Howard Stern. Howard Stern's on to himself. But thank you. What about I, you had Jada Pinkett on? What did you get out of her? Jada was, I love her red table thing. We I always yes. talk talked about it yesterday on the radio saying yes. I love it so much. It's real. You know what? It shows people having a conversation and working things out correctly mm -hmm. instead of fighting or just dissing each other on Twitter. Right. Yeah. So I loved it. I loved every minute of it. The fact that I was also at that same wedding. Tom's wedding. Yes. Oh, you were with there. Leah and Jada there. Did you play hide and seek? There's some hide and seek story. No, I did see Leah though um, ask where the wife was, and oh. um, I saw everybody look around like it was Rosemary's baby, <laughs> and I was like, oh my god, this is crazy. I love it. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> um, it was it was fantastic. I forgot you were at that That's wedding. Good. Jada was super cool and very nice down to earth. Love. Who are I mean. When you think about like the guests that you've had, do you have a dream guest that you would love to just that get my hands on? Yeah, you haven't had already. Um, you know, I'm I'm not really that much of like a like a celebrity lover. Does that make sense? Yeah. yeah. I love having them come on. I love trying to get the dirt yeah. from them. But there's no one where I'm like, please, please, please. Maybe except for Howard Stern. Ah. Howard though is you know very private and and I'm sure wouldn't do it. But that would be one I'd like to get my hands on. Oh my God. Somebody needs to do the reverse interview with Howard. Yeah, that would of course. Be you. Put him on the Come spot. Come on. I would love nothing more in the world. Uh, ambush him. Around. How close is your studio <laughs> next to his? It's only like 50 feet. It's so serious. there you go. Jenny, this needs to happen. But I think Andy. he has the power to also throw me out and get a <laughs> uh, restraining order. Andy Cohen comes on what's great. He said he would go straight for one woman only. And that is you. I love it. What did you get out of Andy on your show? Uh, oh my God, Andy is great because he's also an open book and he gets it. It's like people don't are going to tune into you to kind of find out your deep dark secrets. Here's so something. Andy, yeah. Andy gives it to you. Yeah. And we get really deep on my show. I mean, his sex life on my show. <laughs> yeah. it's triple X. Sorry, Andy. Woo. But it is. Okay, now what about there was uh, an episode we saw a little bit with Tara Reid. Oh my gosh, she got so upset. Was Bob that um, not a good show? You know what? Yeah. I was really excited because I'm yeah. excited for anyone to come in. I'm just grateful they want to do my show. Right. And Tara had come in and uh, she seemed a little off. And I, you know, figured she was either hadn't gone to bed yet. Um, dro drank a certain cocktail or too many or oh. combined or whatever. I don't quite know. Did she reek of alcohol? Um, no, because I wasn't in the same room as her. Oh, okay. But uh, she, I could see her kind of wobbly. And then she didn't want to answer any of the questions and she started getting combative. And then me and my South Side Irish side, <laughs> I could, uh, you could, you, you could only take, take a little bit. You were like, I'm in yeah. until I'm Until not. I went fam fam. Yeah. I'm like. So you asked her about plastic surgery, right? I did. I asked her about, I asked her about the movie as much as I possibly could for at least 10 minutes. And then. The Sharknado uh, 10? Sharknado 18, yeah. <laughs> and she, uh, <laughs> she tried to answer those. And then I said, you know, you look great. You've never shied away from you know, talking about what you've done to your body, whether that's working out or plastic surgery, because she's been open about it. Right. So I thought it was a fair yeah. game question. Yeah. And that's when I got my my butt chewed by that shark. Oh. Um, and as you're, it's going on, are you like, okay, here we go. Let's. Uh... I mean, I was doing, I do BFF Fridays on my radio show, which is fun, because it's my best friends in Chicago. Yeah. Right. And they're with me and they're like, <gasps> oh my God, <laughs> oh my God, <laughs> Jerry's freaking out. <laughs> Like it was, it was so great. Like I don't know. I guess I'm just so used to it. I didn't get freaked out by it. I just kind of knew to stood my, I stood my ground, right. and was respectful as I possibly could, and let her leave the building. <laughs> Jenny, let her leave. Goodbye.
We started out together. Hi, Felicia. You and me on MTV. We did. And I think back, but Jenny was the queen. Like, I always, when I would see you, especially with Singled Out. When yes. Singled Out, I was like, I love that girl. If that hadn't happened, where do yeah. you think your life would be? Oh, my God. That's a really good question. Um, probably still trying. Absolutely. I probably would have wound up making my own once YouTube came around. Oh, yeah. Uh, but I did, you know, audition like 20 times for that show because they didn't want times. they didn't want to audition a playmate. I was a playmate of the year at the time, yeah. and they were afraid my clothes were going to accidentally fly, fly off or something. <laughs> but um, I went in there and, and got the job, and the rest, the is, rest history. is history. Well, speaking of history, not really the segue I thought yeah. I was going to make. Uh, we've got a surprise for you. What? We hear your it's favorite oh. milkshake. Oh. He's in there. Bear is in there. Yes. You guys know who it is. Oh, right. I love Johnny. 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 Aren't you vegan? <laughs> I, I, no, I was. Ellen had me on that for like a few months. Oh, okay. And then I couldn't do now it. Now you're yeah, So good. now you're back Cheers. to the steaks. I am. Yeah. Do you know they're bringing back spring break? MTV's bringing back. Oh, yeah. Break I just heard year. this. Finally! Yeah. Can we go? Oh, this is yummy. I would love to. These are good. I would love to do my. I did my first show, Get Next to Jenny, at MTV Spring Break. Oh, my God. They should do it. Yeah. Right? I feel like they Good. lost their touch. I love all that VJ stuff. In the spring break, they really did it great. They did. Um, how's your son? What's going on? Oh, my God. He's 16. He's doing amazing. Is he driving? He's driving. Oh, my gosh. Uh, he also, you know, said, you know, I Googled myself, and uh -oh. you need to kind of take it easy. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I'm going through puberty, so why don't you just... <laughs> you need to take it easy. <laughs> I'm like, oh, that's really that. hard for Mama. And so I said, you got it. So no more... Stories until he passes the puberty phase. That's so good. Then he'll you're a cool mom again. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. We have a good connection. <laughs> um, and marriage going great. You guys I keeping mean, it spicy? I can't even begin to tell you how juicy and delicious it is. <laughs> oh. How juicy, huh? He is the love of my life. Every day I wake up and I go, oh my God, every night I go to sleep, I go, I, so I, I, I get this. And he's not only like attractive, talented, but he, you guys, he is the most wonderful human being. Wherever we go, the way he talks to people, brings them in, he, he'll literally look at photos and start crying hysterically. At least once a week, because it's photo of a fan touched him. Oh I'm like, my God. he's the nicest guy in the world. Always you giving me charity. Well. I did, I did really well. And a you great deserve stepdad. You deserve all it. of that. I do. Yeah, lucky to have you. It took me a long time yeah. to learn those words. I deserve it. Absolutely you do. worthy. Got the Jenny McCarthy Show airs live every weekday at 10 a.m. Eastern on Sirius XM. It is wild. It is you got to do it. Juicy. Juicy. Every day.